Hello artists, today we're going to practice making lines with our Play-Doh. So you're going to need your Play-Doh bag, and if you still have the placemat that was given to you in the supply bag at the beginning of the year, it looks like this. If you don't have it, that's okay. Um, an adult helper can just draw you some lines on a piece of paper, and it helped me to tape the corners down, so that's an option for you. So open your bag gently, you don't want to pull the zipper all the way off. So take your Play-Doh out, and you're only going to need a little chunk at a time. So you just break off a chunk, and then you just kind of squeeze it and squeeze it, and then you can roll it. Like I'm making a flat hand, and I'm not letting my fingers bend like this and keeping them flat. And I'm just rolling, rolling, rolling. And that's going to make a coil. And it's going to help us make our lines. So then you can take that coil that you made, a little piece off, that's okay, and you can bend it so that it goes on top of the line that you made. Get another piece and squeeze it, squeeze it, squeeze it. Just a little piece is fine. And then you're going to roll it. Roll it, roll it, roll it with your flat hands. You can even use two hands if you want to. You're going to use that coil, that's a big kid artist term, to bend it so it goes on top of your line front. That's Miss Baby. Pick up a chunk. Squeeze it, squeeze it, squeeze it, and roll it. If you get too big of a chunk, it makes it kind of tricky. So if you're having a hard time, think to yourself, mm, maybe I can use a smaller chunk. And look, if you have too much, you can just break it off and use it for another piece. That. And if that's a little bit too challenging for you right now, you can also just pick bits off like this and just connect. Connect them on your line. And just pick off a chunk and press it down to cover your lines. Just like that. Especially for our friend Little Dash here. Pick off a chunk, press it down. Cover your line, friends. So you have two, two different methods you can choose from. You can break off a chunk and squeeze it and roll it like that. Or you can just pick chunks off and stick them down on your paper to cover the line. When you're all done, we need to turn on our silent vacuum cleaners. Click. And then we're going to vacuum up all of our Play-Doh to put it back in the bag. You might not have enough Play-Doh to cover all of your lines. That's okay. You might just make one or two and then do what I'm doing. Just vacuum it up and then start again on a new line. Look on the floor, make sure none of those little pieces fall on the floor. Make it into a nice ball. And then you're going to put it back into your Ziploc bag. And you're going to zip it up. It's good to get all the air out of there. It'll dry up. Have fun!